One of the important aspects that we want to des describe about the battery is how it performs under a micro hybrid type of environment. So we'll, we'll perform a test where we put a hotel load on the battery and then recharge it dynamically so that we see how long a charge step will take as you progress in cycling the battery. And so what you see is that for lead acid, the time it takes to recharge will increase as you continue cycling the battery because the sulfate in the negative electrode will become bigger and bigger and be less soluble. And that's so what we're your seeing charge here. is impeded, and that's okay. what you see in the lead acid battery. With, with the PVC battery, instead of seeing a very large increase in that charge time like you do for standard lead acid, Trying to get to the lead acid one. Here it is. So you go from uh, a charge acceptance, this blue line, that's very high and moves very um, fast and rapidly down to a low value. So your charge acceptance is very low. The black line is your time, which is increasing and gets very bad towards the end. So you see this increase in time and this decrease in charge acceptance. <clears throat> Whereas with the PVC battery, you don't see any decrease in charge acceptance. So the experiment is set up for 100 amp maximum charge acceptance. So you see that over its entire cycle life. And, and, and for that reason, the charge time stays constant at a very low 35 seconds. So that's, that's the big difference between the two. Yeah, okay. Thank